day four of the Millertown. We don't know what, actually that's something we need from you viewers is uh, what do we call this place? We have a couple ideas. Uh, my sister named it Millertown Mansion. Mansion. A friend of mine called it Miller Rehab. We need to we need to have a name of this place. So you uh, you guys name it for us. Show them the snow we got today. Lots of snow. And today we the goal is to I think there's about one or two more bags of garbage to get out of the room and then we're gonna start real ripping up the floor tiles get that all cleaned out I think the tub can go today and maybe we'll start knocking down some walls it's a big day Hi everyone, welcome back to our YouTube channel, Follow Your Arrow. Uh, if you've been following us along on Facebook, you know that we are back in Ontario. Currently, we're sitting on our boat in Tobermory. Uh, we did a ton of work in three weeks on our little house in Millertown. We're so proud of it and we can't wait to get back. You know I'm a mechanic, right? I'm not a carpenter. Seemed to take forever to get that stupid tub out, but I finally got it. This is gonna remain the bathroom. Gonna be a one-piece shower stall there. Stackable washer and dryer right there. Linen closet to the ceiling there. New toilet. Now to rip off the back deck so we can get at the cells to see what kind of shape they're in. It was lunchtime. We brought a lovely little lunch. What do we have? Hummus. Hummus with um, guacamole. Guacamole. And, and crackers yep. and cheese. Do you see these things at the dollar store? They're absolutely unbelievable. And they're gluten free too. <laughs> That's lunch, I've had it back to jacking. We thought we could save the cupboards, but they were beyond disgusting. How's it going, honey? Good. No, we got five pounds <laughs> Tell them what you're doing. What am I doing? Well, we're refabricating a hundred year old uh, house. They uh, ran the upright studs. I had them in mid hanging mid air. So we're going to put a plate across the bottom now and uh, frame it like a real house. One thing about it, once you get the mess out of the way, it doesn't seem like such a big job. Well, my big brother showed up for a day and helped Alan do a whole bunch of the dirty underground work, and I was able to burn all their dirty stuff they broke over in the pot. We even had the neighbors involved, removing some ugly trees. My partner couldn't find her mask, so she's got her bandana over her nose. There's lots of stuff up there. Where's your, where's your glasses? In your hand. I, use my I really wanted to knock the back room off, but once we got at it, a few new floor joists, a few sheets of plywood, got it jacked up, put back together properly, it turned out pretty good, and saved us thousands. We ripped off the ugly old front porch and whipped up a new back deck in no time.
found some soggy old moose antlers we weren't able to save, so they went to the fire. A huge shout out to all our family, friends and neighbors, and the little town of Millertown. You guys are all awesome. The ferry's booked and now it's time to head back to Ontario. Unfortunately, my dad never got to see Newfoundland. <laughs>